Plan d'Avril is without doubt a very strong Welsh independent school. You get that feeling as soon as you walk through the front door. Welsh culture, language and heritage is, is valued and celebrated. Uh, I think the strength of the family in Wales is reflected in the strength of the uh, community. And part of that community is, is, is the expectation that pupils, uh, along with parents uh, and staff, will be engaged in a very holistic educational uh, philosophy. Uh, excellence in the classroom is reflected by excellence uh, outside of the classroom in a very rich and enriching co-curricular programme. I think people really do appreciate how uh, warm and um, informal the school is and it, I think it really does make the school a more successful one because people are working in a, a friendly, happy environment. It does translate through into your work. Encouraging pupils to break free of their uh, own sometimes self-imposed uh, stereotyping, uh, break free of their pigeonholes if you like, uh, to take risks, to uh, try things they've never tried before, um, seek out their own talents. Uh, I think that uh, encouragement that they receive almost on a day-to-day -day basis makes Llandovery College very, very special. I mean, the strengths of Llandovery uh, are that it's got a great sporting ethic. The sporting ethic goes hand in hand with the academic ethic at the same time as a wonderful community feel. The balance between academic and sports here is almost perfect. Obviously the sports is a big part of Llandovery College but also the academics we see as a very strong school in academics and we pride ourselves for our grades and also our sporting achievements. Llandovery is a really happy school. Um, it has a very friendly atmosphere around here. I think because it's small, the relationship between pupil and staff is quite close and I think that really helps. Um, there, there's, not a, 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 there's not a distance between us. Well, it's like a big family. Everyone's, everyone's friends with each other. It's, it's great. There are two schools uh, at Llandovery. There is the Senior College, but there's also our prep school. Uh, and the two schools um, operate on the same campus, uh, share facilities, and of course for the prep school that's wonderful to have senior school facilities uh, on the doorstep. But the schools do operate um, almost entirely independently of each other, so there is that degree of uh, autonomy for both schools within uh, the, the family unity that exists at the college. Plan Every Prep certainly prepares children with everything that they need to go on to succeed and with the links to the college they can go right through. At the prep schools there's a lot of initiatives particularly around children's well-being and celebrating the success of others. Certainly being competitive but enjoying when others succeed. We have a very clear picture and vision of what is successful, what is respectable behaviour, both in the way we conduct ourselves, the way we speak, the way we behave and our, and our attitude towards others. It's okay for boys to sing in a choir. It's absolutely fantastic to play a couple of musical instruments. And that's so important for young children to realise that's an aspiration, that's a dream, that's nothing to be shy or, or scared about. And we look to instill through various initiatives and particularly our co curricular uh, timetable a modest confidence where they know where the boundaries are, they have more of a familiar relationship with staff but the lines between respect are firmly established. I think that balance is essential and if Llandovery Prep School does one thing it's produce an all-rounded child that has that balance between the academic, the need to be fit and physically healthy and to love and respect the outdoors. We often get comments that they are extremely grounded and well-rounded pupils. Tandavi is a small school. The benefits of uh, being a small school are that the pupils um, get to know each other and the staff incredibly well and, and those warm, strong relationships are without doubt one, one of the key features 
uh, of the college. We value the individual. I think we spend a lot of time at Llandovery College um, speaking to them um, on a very individual basis. Very I think the small class sizes help as well um, because you do get to know them extremely well. But our housemasters, our assistant housemasters, our teachers, our form tutors, there's such a big team working with the individual that we get to know them so, so well and I think that really helps. It's very difficult also in a small school for pupils to lurk in shadows, uh, to hide away from expectations or to hide any difficulties that they have and we can um, identify difficulties that pupils are having very, very quickly and because we're a small school we can deal with those issues very, very quickly also. We achieve so much more than schools that have got a thousand pupils, although, and we all celebrate each other's achievements. And so someone's been chosen to play for the Scarlets, or if someone's done a ballet show, or if someone's done well academically or musically, we all kind of celebrate each other and congratulate each other. Academically, we've done incredibly well. I mean, last year we've got two pupils going to Oxbridge, which is amazing for the fact that we are such a small school. We have pupils from all over the world here and it's really lovely seeing them integrate together. Um, we have pupils from Russia, we've had pupils obviously from Hong Kong, from China, from Germany, from Spain, and it's lovely to see them all getting on so well and talking about what they do at home. That's so lovely for our pupils here um, to see that in different parts of the world things are done differently. From the start uh, you feel very welcome and uh, you, you can ask anyone anything. They are very welcome, all the teachers, principal and the students, um, very, um, they are very happy when I come in. That's one of the really great things about college, I think um, I've got to know a lot of people, a lot of very different people from across the world. I'm sure that I'll keep in contact with them. Sport is, is without doubt uh, one of the main preoccupations of the pupils at Andovery College and it always has been, it's very much part of our history, it's part of our DNA if you like. At all levels pupils are active, uh, thoroughly enjoy the sport they take part in and we have been incredibly lucky to have many of our pupils go on to regional um, successes and, and even further such as the Lions test, we now have three former pupils who, who have been taking part, you know, it's, it's absolutely superb. Sport teaches self-discipline, teamwork, determination and also the ability to take failure and loss uh, on the chin if you like and dust yourself off and get on with it. However, we do so many other things as well as we do sports. Our Duke of Edinburgh programme for example sees sometimes two, three dozen pupils a year uh, gaining their gold D of E awards. And then of course our music and drama, a very rich heritage of performance at the college in which all pupils are expected to, to play a part again, to take that challenge, to stretch themselves and do something that they might not ordinarily be used to. Nobody here would ever take for granted the privilege that they have. I think people appreciate the opportunity that Llandovery College gives them, which may not be the same for, uh, for young people in other independent schools. It's just a lovely, simple environment in a wonderful, uh, in a wonderful place in Wales.